It's nice to have so much work in one place like this. I am disappointed in the temple priests who are basically condemning me as a heretic to my face. Though I can be thankful that I'm not being physically attacked. Not yet, at least, anyway. I don't know how word of me being the Nerevarine spread, but I can only guess that the Urshaliku and the Ahimasa have been telling people that trade with them about me. Word has gotten out and spread. It really only takes telling the right person about it, and through their contacts they could tell the entire world about me. Now I'm becoming well known, and not in a good way, at least not good yet. I don't plan to sit around and do nothing, though. I have to become the Hortator. That would require me to be named the war leader by the three great houses here in Vardenfell, with House Hlalu, Radaran, and Telvanni. Then I will need to convince the four Ashlander tribes of this. Once done, there will be no one to stop me, not even Dagoth Ur, and especially not the Tribunal or their blind followers. However, saying that is easier than doing it. It's the doing part that will not be easy. My plan is to still do all the jobs for the various organizations I belong to, but it will culminate with House Redoran. I will be looking to spend my money on a home soon and hopefully be recognized as a high-level House Redoran member. They will also be the first one I convince to name me Hortator. Then I will go to the other two houses and do whatever it takes to win their support and be named as Hortator as well. I believe the Ashlander tribes will be much easier to convince than the houses. How ironic, since when I first went to the Urshaliku to be judged as fit to be the Nerevarine, that pretty much none of them wanted to even speak to me. Now as the Nerevarine, and especially after Julan and his mother have been welcomed back to their camp, I feel closer to the Ashlanders than I do with the Great Houses. Julan. Why would anyone choose to live here? You'd have to be mad. Dust, blight, witches, ugh. Witches? Okay. Oh. So I'm glad everything's been cleared up with your father. How do you feel about it all? Maybe I'll get Mother to tell me more about him sometime. What do you think about Moon and Star? This ring. The Moon and Star. The Mark of the Incarnate. Amazing. It certainly is. Yeah, don't lose it or sell it to a scamp. <laughs> or... Nobody else will put it on. They'll die immediately, apparently. Um, hmm. So, about Shani. Now that she's walked away for a moment. He sniggers. So, you had fun, did you? Ha, huh? you can't say I didn't warn you. How much did you drink? How many guards did you have to knock out? Any other details? Please keep it to yourself. I do not want to know. <laughs> okay. This is the place you like to go to, to have a drink. Why don't we go there? The old scar in. Then I'll hunt oh, down this person for the Morag Tong. What's this? Public notice. Warning to the people of Morrowind regarding the Nerevarine. Well, beloved people of Morrowind, take heed, take warning. The outlaw named Sunil Rilvane stated trade of underworld enforcer lately called incarnate and nerevering is now shown to be to the investigating ordinators and the magistrate of this district to be an agent in the pay of the imperial intelligence service how would they find that out this outlaw's claims are false the prophecies this outlaw cites are discredited the dishonest character and base purposes of the outlaw in perpetrating this hoax are now made clear to all observers. Sunil Relvane is sought for various crimes by ordinators and town guards. Report all encounters with this outlaw to the proper authorities. If you see this outlaw in public, give the alarm. Published by the authority of the temple, the Order of the Watch, Magistrates of Vardenfeld District, under the signature and authority of Grandmaster Beryl Sala, Captain of the Watch, hear and heed. Uh, hi. Hey, Sunil Rilvain. I hope you don't think we're a couple now. What are you talking about? You heard. I don't want you getting any funny ideas after what we did in Moorhold. I don't want a boyfriend. I'm not interested in romance or talking about feelings or being tied down to someone who's getting all jealous of me. I just want to have fun, okay? Hmm. I'm not allowed to care for you about you? No, no, you're not. Nothing stupid like that. No promises, no strings, just fun. Whenever we both want to. If you don't want it anymore, you can get lost. Oh. Okay. Uh, Julian. Why in oblivion did you get me, let me get so drunk back when we first knew, knew each other? Not that I'm blaming you or anything. Maybe we should have a drink. Shani. Uh, I'm not thirsty either. And Julian says, you might not believe this, but I'm really not at all thirsty. 
Well, I am. Come have a drink with me. Well, if you're buying, I wouldn't say no to Matsu. You do look like you could use a drink. Shiny says, thank you, but I really don't want anything. I'll go get some. Okay. What is I don't know why you, you guys what like do this you want? drink. Matsu. I'll just get a few of them. Our Thanks. doors are always open. Yes? You want a drink? Here you go. Ah, thanks. Do you feel like having another one? Here you go. Much appreciated. Care for another? Here you go. <laughs> Thank you. Let's have one more. I forgot to drink to the Emperor's good health. Starts giggling uncontrollably. Um, here you go. And here you go. You're going to drink them all? Great. How about another? I think you've had enough. Oh, all right, Snow Rovain, but only because you're my friend. Come on, let's get out of here. I want to find Ordinator. Aren't you? Yes, I've heard that before. And you don't want anything yes. to drink. <laughs> okay, I don't even want to talk about that right now. That she said it was very immature. Let's just let uh, Julian be drunk. I'll drink one of my brandies. The Aldrin Council Club. You know, I've never really gone in here. I don't even know what's in here. Welcome, friend. You're nearly a legend around here. Please, talk. He notices about me. Hello. Good day, Dark Elf. I'm Draven Laren, publican of this tavern. How may I serve you? We rent beds, and I can offer you something to eat or drink. If you're new here, I can tell you where to look for services, specific place nearby. If you're looking for someone in particular, I may be able to help you. Mm, no. It's okay. Thank you. Okay, so, actually, what, Shani demanded to know whether I considered us a couple, claiming that she wasn't interested in romance, talking about feelings or being tied down. She just wanted to have fun. <sighs> Shani? Go ahead. So, what about us, what about us being together? What's the matter? Oh, never mind. Our relationship. I told you we don't have a relationship. We're just having fun together, that's all. Okay, then I just wanted to kiss you. <sighs> she smiles, slowly twines her arms around my neck and kisses me to within an inch of my life. Okay. She says, oh, cut it out, you two. Sure, Gora. <laughs> okay, there's entirely too many people in my way. Hello. Welcome to Aldrune, Snow World Vane. I'm Voline Leru, Knight. Are you new here? I don't believe we met, but you know who I am. Actually, it's very small down here. I expected this Three place blessings to be larger. To you, Outlander. This is Where a is a bed? He said they rent beds. There was a door upstairs, though. Behind him? There's a door here. Oh. Okay. Now, despite Shani and her immaturity, maybe she just was hurt before, she doesn't want to get hurt again, but still, it's a sign of immaturity. Been through enough with uh, Julan. Okay, so, I'm looking for the Morag Tong. House Redron, Andres Narando, Slander, that's right. Um, I must find Andres Narando and Balmora and challenge him to, okay, what's Balmora? I have a Dwemer too, but I have to give it to the Legion. Milch's Guild, Morag Tong. Morag Tong, ultima ultimatum for Movis Darius. Grandmaster, you know, Halalu wants me to speak with Movis Darius at the Guild of Mages in Aldruin. I must either convince him, him, I thought it was a her, to join the Morag Tong or kill him. Where does he live? He's in the Mages Guild in Aldruin. He is posing as a student in the Imperial School there. Speak with him, and if I cannot convince him to join my cause and his life, he is not like the others in the Dark Brotherhood. If I must kill him. Make sure his death is honorable. Okay. Which means that I'll have to uh, get him to get very angry at me if he won't join. I have no idea how this is going to go. But I am quite familiar with the Mage's Guild. Imagine jumping this far in this armor. Ha! 
How about sharing that... the wealth? I've lots to show you. Uh, I don't even want to hear about that. <laughs> Movis Dairies. That's gotta be a Dunmer name. I actually remember a student. Look how he's dressed. Well, I can spare a few moments. So good to see you. He's cut a green, a glass sword. I knew it was you. You're Movis Darius, aren't you? I'm fine, thank you. What can I do for you? I spoke to him for a few minutes. Made him see uh, that I'm a good person to confide in. So, about joining the Morag Tong. Morag Tong? But I'm just a simple peasant. What do I know about killing and all that? We know who you are. If you do not join, I will give you an honorable death. <sighs> if you know, then it is over. I swore an oath to the Dark Brotherhood, but I have learned that their ways are not as honorable as Mark Tong. All I can promise is that I will speak with Eno Hlalu. If that is enough, report to him. If not, I will test your skill. Take this belt as a sign of my good faith. A belt of sanguine denial. Well, there's nothing more I can do about that. What is this belt? Oh. Oh. That's actually more useful than what I have. Belt representing one of the 27 legendary threads of the web spinner once belonging to Movis Darius of the Mage's Guild of Aldrin. See, the problem is he may want that. Once belonging to Movis Darius at the Mage's Guild. You know what? I'm going to wear it for now. It increases my block. Fortified block. The enchant on it. How can I help you? I don't remember what you do. Who, who, uh, hello, Snow Rovey. My name is Vala Ka Katarasso, and I run a little class for Outlanders new to Morrowind. You may find it easier to get along here if you know a little bit about Morrowind lore. I'm also a priest, and I'd be happy to talk to you more about my trade. Uh, I'm not really an Outlander, even though I get called that for this uh, Akatosh necklace that I proudly display, but... About Morrowind lore, tell me. In case you didn't know, weapons armor are less effective when they get worn out. Repair them yourself if you have the skill, or take them to a smith or repair. That is not Morrowind lore, by the way. That's universal lore. Everywhere, it's like that. So, uh... Yes. Spoke to her. She was... Okay. What about your trade? I don't see how the details of my trade concern you. You just told me... You just told me you would, you'd like to talk to me about your trade. You are a priest, right? I am Vala Catrasso, a priest. Strange woman. Imperial Cult Alt Alt Altar. Interesting that you have everything here. I wonder if anybody will buy the Your actions that was precede given. you, Outlander. I've heard good things about you. I'm Tremora, Tremona Maron, commoner. Welcome to Aldrun, the district seat of House Redrun. Are you looking for someone in particular? No, well, thank you. Okay. So that was interesting. Hmm. How about? Well, that was the only thing left I had to do How here. Does the day Divine intervention will take me right there. That's actually really neat, actually. Divine intervention. Let's go. How are you? Fort Buckmoth. I've only been here once before. Where is she? She's actually a really good looking Nord woman. I have to give them the credit when they're that attractive. I don't know if this is the way to there. I don't think it is. You know, just going along the, f the wall of the fort. This is the inside of the wall. Let's go to the door over here. Hello. Well, here's a uh, fine one. I'm out of uniform. Speak freely. This is why I carry this. Hello. What's the situation with Drenar Varen? Have you found any evidence in Drenar Varen's home? Yes, here it is. This, along with the word of a member of the Legion, should be enough to convict him. I will let you know when we catch him. <laughs> can I get an advancement? You can fight with the best of them, but you don't seem to understand how to follow orders. Do you have any orders? I need you to rescue a knight of the Order of Evenheart. Johnsis Dalomax. Johnsis is being held in Ashurnaribi. That sounds familiar. A Daedric ruin on the island northwest of Hla'od. Oh, just west of there is where I originally spoke to 
Boethia about the sword I have. We cannot afford the ransom. Go there and rescue Johnsus Delamax if he still lives. A data crew on the island northwest of Flat Oak. Yeah, looking at it on my map. Okay. Are you sure you know the way? I'm pretty sure I know the way. Hello. I don't think we've been introduced, Outlander. I'm Ariane Lyric. Can, how can I help you? What do you sell? Ah, just the person I'm looking for. So, got a few potions to get rid of. Oops, not that one. Potion cure blight and common disease. Thank you. What training do you offer? Restoration. I could use that. Um. Well, I find guys, make yourselves at home. I have some training to do. Please share your thoughts. Restoration. Oh, you teach me nothing more about that skill. Hmm. Okay. Okay. I trained a bit in restoration. You hear a storm going outside. Hello again. It's an attractive Imperial woman. I had to report to her for something. Uh, I think the day is getting late. Julian? I am so sorry for giving you so much trouble, Sunil Relvane. Thank you for rescuing me from the clan fears and for training me and for not hitting me very hard when I spilled Matsy all down your front. Ah. So you're okay with Shani and I having fun together? Who? <laughs> Shani? What do you. Yeah, pfft! She spits. Ash in my mouth. Ugh, I know. <laughs> the worst is when it's mixed with rain. Okay. I've got another one for you, Shani. I say this. Yes? Thoughtful gift. Here, I brought you a flower. Oh, it's beautiful. What is it called? Timsa Kumbai? I've never seen a flower like this before. You must travel to exotic places. Let's just have... Let's go rest. Nothing else to do at the moment. Get up nice and early. <sighs> okay. Ooh, ooh. I'm gonna wake up. Wake up. Julian. Hammer out the dents in my armor. Fix my weapons. Alright, now, what do we do? Maybe I should have looked. Looked with in here. I think we should go to Balmora, actually. Let's go see if I can't get that uh, guy to duel me if he doesn't back down. Challenge him to withdraw his statements. That sounds like fun. You ready to go see a duel? Then you have to leave. On CV With intervention. Pleasure. Please, go ahead. Three blessings, friend. Do you want something? Guess I'm going with the wind. Let's see if there's a new newspaper out. Welcome, friend. Maybe that's about me. Oh, being the Nerebarine. I can see that being the case. So good to see you. Greetings, I'm a Silt Strider Courier. Would you like a recent edition of our newspaper to enjoy during your trip? I spoke to him for a few minutes, obviously with the scribbly scree flying around us. Do you have a recent edition of newspaper? Varvar Strathi's name has been cleared of the murder he was accused of. The circumstances of the crime that have been revealed during the investigation are quite unsettling, though. This is about what I just did. Let's go to the Mages Guild. Oh, actually, what would it be like to travel? <sighs> yeah. Let's travel. Scenic travel to Balmora. 
gonna take a few hours. Okay, so as for what... I don't need this note. Incriminating letter from Beto Allen to Forvan Barano. Okay, I, this is from Mournhold. We don't need this anymore. Okay, where are the... Other nine, where is this? To go to pastures, hospitality papers, some visions of stranger. Varva Sarethi is innocent. Previously reported on Varva Sarethi, the Radaran nobleman accused of murder, a retainer of House Radaran has successfully proven that he was innocent and under the influence of evil magic. The Temple of Ald Rune did not wish to comment on the nature of this evil magic. The team of the Siltstrata Courier, while happy that the reputation of Sarethi has been restored, is greatly concerned by this news. Is this evil magic something which would threaten the peace and stability of our society? Can other people become possessed by it and murder their loved ones in cold blood as Sarethi did? We hope that Sarethi's case was exceptional and such a thing will not happen again. I hope so too. These ash statues that are being passed around everywhere, though, I don't know what to say about that. We're gonna have to find the people who are doing it. I caught them in all room. But I'm sure it's in every town, every city in Vardenfell. Really see much. Well, there's Fort Buckmoss, so we're heading east, are we? Are we gonna go by the ghost gate? If there wasn't if there wasn't an ash storm, I'll bet you I could see the ghost gate. Or ghost fence, I should say. Should be right there. Okay, well now we're heading south. No, we're heading Oh, okay, so you went down a path that way, and now we're heading south. This is the Bitter... Bitter Coast, is it not? No. It looks like West Gash. It's not the Bitter Coast. I like it when you guys tell me about the locations we're passing by. As it comes to rain. Well, you know, if we travel straight over the hills, we'll make it to Caldera, or sorry, Balmora, really fast. This is the Bitter Coast. Caravanner. Hmm, it's raining again. I don't like mounting the Guar Skin Tent, but sometimes it's the best thing to do, Underworld Enforcer. I'm not actually sure why we didn't just go past Caldera and then south right into Balmora. We don't even have to be in the Bitter Coast. Whoa. Ah, branch hit my helmet. Yeah, you know that Balmora is behind us, right? This is actually where I have to go. Pla Ode is right by. This is where, where the person is being held for ransom. Oh, wait. This... That's a Dwemer ruin. It's this place. La Ode should be just south of here. Should it not? Okay. No. I'm in the wrong place. There's another Dwemer ruin. Or Daedric ruin. To the south of here. That's what I was thinking. That's it right there. And La Ode should be just over here. Are we going to Balmora, or are we going to Sedyanin? That's where I need to go. There's... That oh, should be somewhere right around here.
It's actually kind of pleasant right now out here. Or is this the Daedric ruins I need to go to? Daedric Shrine. One of these. There's Flau. Okay, so he's going to go up the Odai River is what he's going to do. He's going to turn... Um, smuggler ship. Oop. Yeah, he's probably going to turn left now. Should be the Odai. Wow, we are deep. Oh yeah, this is the river Odai going up that way. And I've never come out to see this sunken ship. It's nearby where I've been quite often. It's on the other side. Not sunken, it's beached. Walk right over the bridge beneath us. Don't trip. Actually, it's past this bridge, right around the corner up ahead on that hill. That's where I did one of my first duties or, or the orders for the Fighters Guild. Go in the mine there. At least here in uh, Vardenfell. Back home, I did a few for the Fighters Guild, even though I wasn't really a member. I was just more like an assistant. Not skilled enough to become a member, but I trained long and hard. That's how I became so proficient with sword play. Sword fighting. Okay, so where does he live? He's a Lalu noble. Andres Narano. Find him at Andres Narano and Balmara. Challenge him. I have it written down where his home is. Well, there's a Hlalu Council Manor. There's a Narano Manor. Okay, we're going to go to the Narano Manor. It's this way. Juland, you want to train? Uh, uh, uh. Ow, my head. Shigoreth, why did you let me drink so much? I swear I'm never touching alcohol ever again. Oh, gods, I think I'm going to be sick. I think you are sick. Let's, uh, train. How about I teach you something? Weapon skills. Oh. Uh, marksman. Marksman weapons, is it? Okay, wait. What are you putting on my head? No, 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 no. Not bad idea. Get that ash jam off. <laughs> okay, Narano Manor is here, is it not? I believe. Yep. This should be interesting. Andres Narano. Are you Andres Narano? Hey. A visitor, and an outlander too. What brings you to Narano Manor? I have to speak, uh, I went and spoke to him for a little while. And he thinks I'm a good, good myrrh. Okay, so, I'm here to speak to you about the slander, actually, that's why I came. Slander. I told the truth about Bolvin Venom. I guess you red Redorans are too dumb to know when the, what the truth is. If you want to duel over this, you got one. Okay? 
challenge you to a duel. You will suffer. All right, we'll duel right here, right now. When you're ready, Snail Rovane. Uh, didn't you actually expect that. Where's your weapons, fool? You fight pretty well for a veteran. I take back what I said about Bolvin Venom. Okay. Need I call the gods? <sighs> then we are done here. Actually. A warm welcome to you. You'll be healed from that. That worked out very well. All right. So, I have to go up to Nisus to find somebody who got lost in the way to the cold cave. And I think that there's... Oh, a Sh Shinaribi. Maybe we should go to there first. I think we will. West of... Uh, Flatwood. Northwest of Flatwood. Let's go find this person that's been taking ransom. 